What is up everybody, White Lighting HWD here with another video and today I want to start this video off by showing you guys an epic 3 star on a 100% max out base that I got and it was just super sexy. So if you guys look right here, I got a 3 star on this guy, Mr. Truco, and uh, his base was worth a total of 4 trophies with 450,000 gold and 376,000 elixir. This was a humongous raid and I did 3 star, let's go check it out. Alright, so as you can see his base was a dead base, this was a super duper lucky find. Uh, I couldn't believe I found this and I actually saw this base raided in the top clan so I kind of knew how to do it. Uh, so we got a hound going in on this air defense up here with some balloons to take out those air defenses and the air defense. And another hound on this right side with some balloons over on this line of defenses to get that out of the way. Uh, basically you want to break these chains of defenses so that you can put all the balloons up top right here. And they will go straight towards the middle of the base. So here comes the minions behind to help clean up the buildings on these sides. And then basically all I got to do now is just wait for the balloons to get towards the middle of the base. And since this is all dead in the middle, I will not have to use the free spells um, on these defenses necessarily. I will in, in a second here because this air sweeper is a fucking bitch. I, I hate the air sweepers, man. Those are my least favorite defenses in the world. So balloons are going to be working their way through the middle of the base here. I really wasn't worried about the air sweeper yet. Uh, because the balloons were kind of out of reach of most of the defenses But now the Archer Queen and those Teslas are going to work So I threw down that free spell on the Archer Queen This freaking air sweeper and then one of those Teslas And the balloons will get through all of the defenses in the middle of the base Completely clear the entire center out uh, and that free spell will be lifted and the queen will help take out the rest of those balloons so The balloons are gonna die out in a second here I'm gonna throw all six wall breakers on this side of the base Which probably wasn't the smartest thing to do, but I did it anyways because fuck it And then I put down the archers the king and queen combo and I still have one free spell and one poison spell I will be using uh, to take care of this botch queen in the middle here because she was definitely the biggest threat in this raid And honestly, I almost did not get the three star it came pretty close uh, so we got the king going around, the queen will be taking out those storages, and the king will be going down for these defenses. Uh, so everything's going pretty well. The queen, unfortunately, is going to tag onto my king. And I'm going to use the special ability along with a free spell and poison spell down on the queen and the defenses. But unfortunately, the queen is going to sniper my king and uh, kill him before he gets to that wall. So the king is dead. Now my archer queen is going to run over here and get a couple shots off on this cannon. Uh, actually, take that cannon out. The turn around, bitch slap the queen. I got to use the special ability, though. Barely snipes the queen over the wall there. That was incredible. Uh, and then my Archer Queen will take out this Archer Tower, get that out of the way, and that will be the last defense down that is really threatening my uh, troops. And 95%, uh, we got the Town Hall in the middle here, a couple minions on it. The Queen, we're taking out the rest of these buildings, basically getting our way to that 100%, and we're closing in on it, guys, almost to the 100. Bam, that is down. Now the Queen will be shooting this wall for the rest of the raid. That's a shocker, right? The Queen shooting a wall. What? And uh, these minions are basically going to take out this town hall. We'll speed through it because it takes a little while. But the minions can we take out the town hall for the three star. 99% one star. The queen coming in to help. Bam. There it is, guys. Three star on a max base. Uh, I know this guy was a dead base. Uh, he didn't have a clan castle or he didn't have any like core defenses uh, charged up or any traps. But still, he still had a 100% maxed out base. Just punched my mic in the face. I'm sorry if you heard that. And uh, that was still a three star up in the Titans 2 league with a ton of loot. And uh, that was an awesome raid to start the video off. So now what we will be doing, since we got a quite a bit of Dark Elixir from my stream on Camcord, all the links to the uh, download and shit, if you guys want to see me stream, is in the description, by the way. But we got a bunch of Dark Elixir, 183,000, and we only need 185,000 to upgrade the Queen. So we're very, very close to that. So what we're going to do now is uh, basically go out and try to find at least one or two more raids, uh, grab some loot, and basically stock up on it so we can upgrade our queen and possibly some more defenses in the future. Let's go. All right, guys. We were looking for loot, and we found it. This guy is uh, BJ Randandros TM, and he's worth only one trophy, but has a total of 549,000 gold, 492,000 elixir, and 3,000 dark elixir. And we'll be going in on his base right here. So we're going to go from the right side uh, with our Lava Loonian attack, mainly because it looks, I, I don't know, it just looks like this. I don't want to attack. So there goes a balloon in right there. Uh, and the Hound, we'll get some more going in up here. Okay, let's do the... Oh, shit, he's got Clan Clay, Clan Clay Castle Troops. Okay, Poison Spell down there. Let's do the other Hound going in over here with all of these balloons on this side. And we'll get another Rage Spell going in right there. And then we'll put the rest of the 12 balloons kind of right in this area. Let's follow it up with the Minions. And uh, we should be getting right into the middle of the base here, guys. Okay, let's see it. Now, with the free, let's put a free spell down on the queen and on these defenses right here because we need our balloons to go straight towards the middle. Come on, balloons. Come on, get in there. Hurry up. Hurry up, balloons. Okay. Oh, the queen is dead. Awesome, dude. The minions freaking clutch that shit. We'll do another free spell right here to get those defenses frozen. And uh, now the balloons and minions can be working their way through the middle of the base. They are doing awesome right now, actually. This raid's going very, very well. Oh, and all the minions died. Awesome. Well, uh, the balloons can be taking on a couple more defenses. We do not need the town hall since it's only a one trophy offer. Uh, we can basically just get the rest of the loot and kind of leave. And there's a bunch of gold in this left side that I want to grab. Oh, my God. Excuse me. And uh, we got a couple minions on the bottom over here. Uh, that are taking care of a lot of these buildings and a lot of this loot. So hopefully we can get the rest of the loot on the bottom. Uh, and then we'll go from the top left with the rest of our troops, like our heroes and stuff. 
uh, to get all of that. So I'm going to save these three minions because uh, I kind of want that Dark Elixir right there. Um, so we're going to save the three minions for a little bit. And we'll use the heroes on the left side. Hopefully we can get, you know, at least one gold storage. If we can get two, that'd be great. But I highly doubt we can get both of those gold storages. But hey, man, we can try. Um, but other than that, I really don't know where else to attack from. I will put the rest of the three minions in right here. Because they're not going to get much farther. Alright, so let's put the king right there. Let's put the queen right here. Uh, and then we'll do three. Okay, the king is going to go straight towards that wall. Alright, that was weird. Three wall breakers. Oh, make it. Oh, God. Okay, barely getting there. Okay, and then the king. What is that? The walls open up and then the king runs away. Alright, sick king. We'll do three wall breakers right there. Hopefully they can make it through. Because uh, we need the king to kind of swing in towards the mid. Alright, you know what? I'm, I'm done here. This is just... God, this fuck, fucking king, man. Alright, king special ability can be used right there. He'll probably have to run all the way around the wall again. Yep, I saw that coming from a while away. So now it's up to the king and queen basically to soak up the rest of the loot. Uh, the king should be able to grab a couple of those uh, buildings right there. And then the queen, I'm not sure what she's going to do with her AI. Uh, she'll probably go towards this elixir right here. Yeah, she'll take the elixir. Uh, and then she'll take all these skelly traps. And then from there, who knows? She'll probably just go straight down here. Yeah, okay. So she's going to take a couple more buildings out. Uh, we'll use their special ability. We'll use the rest of these six archers down here, although they'll probably get killed in like a second. Uh, that's okay. Queen's shooting the wall, so we'll end battle right there. And that is going to be a total of 405,000 gold, 492,000 elixir, 2,600 dark elixir, plus our giant ass bonus. So that was an awesome raid. 75% on this 100% maxed out. Bam! Farming and Titans. All right. So as you can see in the middle of the base here, we do have enough dark elixir to upgrade the queen. We have 188,000, and she only cost, <laughs> emphasis on only, cost 185,000. So we have 3,000 more than we need but we are not gonna upgrade her just yet I'm gonna save this upgrade this queen upgrade uh, for the next loot montage video which will be this week so do not worry we will upgrade the queen this week uh, but I want to save it because I, I don't know I just want to do something for the loot montage and that will be a special thing so uh, make sure to stay tuned for the loot montage video where we upgrade this biatch to level 37 uh, and then get her that much closer to level 40 level maxed out 40 I cannot wait for that honestly dude a level 40 queen that'll be fucking awesome so you guys that's pretty much all I wanted to show for today's video and uh, yeah we will do the queen next video I promise or next loot montage video which will be probably like, next video and uh, yeah I did do one stream on camp Camcord today, by the way, guys. If you guys have not followed me already on Camcord, the link to that is in the description. Go, so go check me out if you guys want to see me live stream. Because a lot of you guys have been asking for live streams, and I am finally doing them. So go in the description uh, and then go download Camcord and follow me there. So let us get to today's common question of the day. All right, guys. So today we have actually two common questions of the day, which kind of go hand in hand. The first one is by Sam Brock, and the question is: Did YouTube interfere with schoolwork? Does it affect your grades? Shout out to T. Michael, by the way. And the other one is by Stephen Marquette, and the question is: How is your senior year going? Uh, I'll answer the second one. Senior year, uh, it's only the second week of senior year. Uh, it's going all right. I mean, it's been all right. It's been okay. It's been kind of shitty uh, for different reasons. But so far, all together, it's been pretty good. And I'm actually very, very excited to see how it goes for the rest of the year. I'm actually really excited for this year, uh, senior year. It's definitely going to be a fun one. We're going to make it a fun one, me and squad. Uh, and the question to Sam Brock, uh, does YouTube interfere with schoolwork? I, I would say so. Does it affect your grades? Uh, senior year, I don't think it's going to really affect my grades because I have really, really easy classes this year. So I have a lot of time in school. Uh, I have a new upload and edit schedule. I edit uh, during the day. So basically, I record. Like right now, it's about 10 o'clock p.m. And I'm recording the end of this video. So I record videos at night. Uh, I edit in the morning and throughout the day at school. And then I upload them at school. So I can still upload between 12 and 3. Oh, skip. And I have a little bit of time after school to like hang out with friends and whatnot. So I don't know. I've kind of got a little new schedule going. Um, so it doesn't really interfere with schoolwork. Uh, what, does it interfere with classes? Sometimes. I mean, because I edit during classes when I have nothing else to do in the class. Um, and, you know, honestly, that and my editing is a lot more important than some of the stuff we're working on in class, like painting. Uh, I, I mean, I love painting, but I don't think I'm going to need it as an actual skill in life. But I, I still paint. And I'm still one of the tops in the class, goddammit. But, I mean, you know, if I, if I need to edit, then I need to edit. But, um, and, and at my school, we have, like, collaboration periods where basically for, like, a long-ass time, we can do whatever we want work-wise. And that helps a lot with my editing. But, um, I wouldn't say it interferes with school or anything like that, but it, it definitely interferes with school and stuff like that. It interferes with my social life a lot, actually. Um, there's a lot of times where I'd like to go out and do stuff with my friends, but I can't because either I have to stream uh, Camcord now. I'm starting to stream, uh, like, you know, twice a week on Camcord. Uh, or I gotta make a video, or, you know, maybe I'll miss a little bit of something because I gotta make a video. It really, I don't know. YouTube, it's a full-time job. You know, what can I say? I, it's literally a full-time job for me. Um, and I gotta balance that with school and with friends and whatnot. So it's kind of tricky at times. Um, and it does kind of, I do prioritize it over school sometimes, over friends sometimes. It's just, you know, it's a full-time job. It's my, it's my career right now, pretty much. Um, so I kind of have to prioritize it over some things. But, I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't kill my grades. It didn't kill my grades last year. Um, and it's not gonna kill them this year. 
Uh, but I definitely do do YouTube during school hours and whatnot. And we are just skipping bases all around here. So, uh, yeah, guys, that was today's comment questions, questions of the day and today's video. If you guys enjoyed that, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you have not already, and uh, comment down below your comment questions of the day. Also, if you guys are not following me on Camcord and you guys want to see me stream live streaming, uh, I, I'm actually doing a lot of live streaming now twice a week again that I said that already and uh, the links to all that if you guys want to download camcord and go subscribe to me Well, not subscribe but follow me on camcord. That's all in the description So uh, go hit me up on there and we will do some streaming together and it's actually very very fun So yeah guys, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. I love you all. Peace Girls in class still, they never reply, but never say never, they never get caught on my mind. I'm trying to get better and grind, measure my effort and skill, gets better in time, fresher than ever, and I am who I am, no taking it back, I'm alive and well.